welcome everyone to saturday night session two we got operation frigid spider i am wilbur uh we're gonna be playing on balea tonight with the snow uh we're gonna be getting the russian forces versus the u.s forces but uh hopefully you're having a good weekend hopefully you had a great week so like i said we're gonna be getting the russian forces against the U.S. forces. I know that's a little bit different than what we usually do, but the Russian forces are going to be the ones attacking, and the U.S. forces will be the ones defending. Looking at the op map, uh, the Russian forces are going to be starting at a chosen platoon patrol base. Uh, they need to patrol a set of key points or reported U.S. positions to gain intel and strength on the posture. And the Russian forces at the end of their patrol must build a cop to protect their gains in the valley and further advance their attack. So they'll have to patrol either those red dots or the green dots. And then, of course, the U.S. forces, they'll be starting in Maine. Down there on the south. And they must find the Russian forces and defend against their patrols and probes. If the Russian forces continue to press their patrols, find their forward operating cop and destroy it and eliminate all hostile activity in the Balea Valley. That was a weird little, I don't know, well, you all didn't see the flash on the screen. Uh, so commands for tonight for round one on the Russian side, we'll be having lawn darts in command. His two IC is going to be Blackbeard. And then we'll have Alpha Guido, Rose Dragon, and Dick folks. With the rest of the SLs. And then over on the U.S. side for round one, we got Expert in command. His 2IC is going to be Oddball, followed up by Mr. Raggy, Adikin, and Frost. And then loadouts for tonight. Starting on the Russian side, they are getting oh, one SL, two FTLs, one Medic. And then across the entire platoon, they'll spread out six ARs, two MGs, and five Ammo Bears. Uh, vehicles are unavailable. And then their FOB and logistics, they'll just get that COP radio at the end and they'll be able to set down a FOB and various defensive structures. But along the way, the commander will have support actions of four 155mm artillery smoke barrages, two 81mm mortars, uh, six rounds HE. And then once the patrol is complete and the COP location is reached, they'll finally get a supply drop to help them build up all of their uh, various defensive structures. And then for the U.S. side tonight, they're going to be getting one SL, two FTLs, one medic across the entire platoon. They'll be spreading out six ARs, two machine gunner, two MGs, medium machine gunners, and five ammo bears. Uh, they will, unavailable to them are the vehicles and FOB and logistics, but they will be getting four 82 millimeter six round mortar barrages. And let me bring you into the game. We got we got everyone that's uh they're spawning in now. Command is here going over his brief with his squad leaders. Those are just loud. There's there's three I'm gonna call them yellow, but they're the green markers. Um assuming we get that southern one down first, then we'll probably do the western one and then we'll make a push for the one near uh, US main in Delta 11 last, but it really just depends. The, the third one we get to, assuming we do, will be the one that we set up a follow on. Now, if anyone's uh, alive in command net. So he's going the green route. From me, but pull the map up again. Requested, so that's assuming I'm dead. So he's going to go out to those green oh, markers. Those are located at Hotel 9 2, so be aware that Charlie cluster, 8 cluster, 4 9. Cool, I'll drop mortars on them or if went the wrong way. Smoke, Delta 1164. Those are those locations. Hotel 92, Charlie 849, Delta 1164. And he's going to go into a platoon brief. Oh, I found we should give up, we should give up war and play hide and seek oh, all day. You got found. You got found. Found. Were you guys playing hide and seek? Yes, yes. maybe. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> you did not find me. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hello, oh, who, who did I not find? Who did I not find? Me. Oh, right there, right there. Look at that. I'm looking at you. Found you. <laughs> Got him. <'em. Yep. laughs> they had a pile of this snow just so they could stand on it. 
Dude, fire sledding. Okay. Alright, you're the last person I've, I saw a nuclear twister. <laughs> oh, never mind. Renegade. Alright, guys, listen up. Welcome to Operation Frigid Spider. My name is Lawn Darts. I have the pleasure of being your commander this evening. We have Blackbeater's 2IC, and then uh, chain of command after that will be in squad lead order. So, 234, so Rose, Alpha, and Dix Folk. The mission that uh, we're going to try and fulfill here is the green route. So, they're marked on your maps, because I don't have a green marker, by the yellow fob markers. We're going to send two squads to the south uh, on uh, on start. They'll be Rose Dragon on the helmet mark. I'll let him uh, petition his fire team as he likes. He might want to put one across the road. I'll leave that to him. And Dix Folk on the uh, marksman mark. Your mission is to scout the location in Hotel 927, look out for American troops. Americans can start anywhere south of the 1011 line. So uh, really do expect them to be coming from uh, strange angles. We're going to have Alpha with Blackbeard heading southwest at live. Alpha's going to position somewhere around the sniper mark and Blackbeard's going to be supporting him to his west on the heavy anti-tank mark in Echo 8. Now, at the point we'll make a decision if we're going to push for the Hotel 927 objective first or maybe just entertain the Americans there while our other two squads in the west push for the western objective. Either which way, this will be a bit of a fluid op. It will depend where the Americans are as to what order we do the patrol in. But uh, if all goes to plan, we'll do Hotel 9 first, then Charlie 8, then Delta 11. But like I said, if the Americans are uh, in the way, we might choose to go around them. We may even choose if we find an American force that we outnumber to just try and kill them where we find them. We'll just uh, play that for you. Any questions? ROE. Uh, pass it up to your SL and he'll let you know. Uh, obviously, I didn't say um, that, Keller. If you do get shot at, though, I want <laughs> maximum firepower back in the direction you get shot at. Be really aggressive. Um, these hills, they'll have maybe the advantage because they uh, be lying in wait for us. So if you see any Americans, call it out um, to your SL. If you take any fire, return fire immediately and then pass it up the chain of command. Any other questions? All right, sweet squad leaders. We've got about 40 seconds to live. Let's, uh, let's get set. Scope one on me in the scope. Uh, I doubt expert favors yeah, one operation over the other. If he does, he's never made it known. Uh, but Don't be shy, for the general, I'm not gonna say this. The, the general outcomes of the ops and what we look for, people having fun. I think a lot enjoy the attack and defend. But we try to throw these type of patrol I missions in here and there. Kind of Western break it up a little bit so it's not always attack and defend. Uh, so a lot of intel, a lot of good call outs. Make sure you include how many. And here we are. We're live with round one of Frigid Spider. I like that name. Don't know why, but I do. Let's see if we can't see where the U.S. forces are going to be moving out. Oh, it looks like Squad 4 is going to be running straight into a majority of the Russian platoon. 2 is going to be in a good position. 2 and 3 is going to be in a good position. And 1 might be in an even better position to flank across. Hopefully they don't get caught by Alpha, Guido, and Blackbeard's squads. They end up being a pretty interesting fight. Try to get a general overview of movements of both platoons. Because the map is still a mess. The only thing that I don't, the only thing with like spiders, there's only six points between the two. Spiders have eight legs. Man, it's a I can count. No signs of enemy activity. Proud of myself. Roger, four. Science. Put 
good thing about this map playing an op on it is there's a lot of foliage a lot of trees it's gonna be hard for spotting might be getting a lot of close engagements quick reaction is going to be key I'm getting our first engagement here real quick. Moving along this snow, you stick out like a sore thumb. Looks like the Russians yeah, noticed them first. Roger four. Uh, get a good primo, get secure there too, same. Make sure you're watching your eastern map order. Let me know if I move to flank you four on your west across the road. Pretty good mark. Four enemy contacts on the blue smoke. Might be seeing a nope. I thought we were gonna see a feint with uh lagger pulling back and these individuals down here moving forward. But I guess they're all gonna retreat back. Well, not retreat, just pull back. Or are you seeing any more contact over there? Uh, not at the moment, negative. We're moving south in, in pursuit of... Copy that. Command for squad one. Yep, go for squad one. You and any contact yes, or anything over there. Contact you. south of us pulled back. Negative. Oh, snap. I don't think they're firing this way. Oh, yes, they are. Their laughs a lot. Takes a hit. Right, be advised. We don't, we've got um, guys already south of my Bravo fire team. If you push up that ridge, you're going to be uh, slotting. Taking, Charlie's taking an overshot, we can try and sneak this objective. Roger, if if you could uh, head that way west, I'll come in behind you to your north. One is currently flanking those contacts right now. Roger. There's command for you and for just hold a strong position. Understood, I am holding. Got two kills for the U.S. forces. Now one for uh, the Russians. I did not know that about spider webs. That is awesome. My brain just grew i felt it i like i like little bits of knowledge like that 
That's that's some good stuff. Got a lot of injuries going for the Russians right now. Gus is putting up a really good fight. Tinkerbell's in the thick of it. Oh, good mortar call in. Oh, that must have been a grenade. I hear the mortars over here. Contacts all over the map. Yeah, can you handle We're working on it, but I'm taking casualties. I've lost half or most of my Bravo fire team. We're probably going to disengage and follow you in. Yeah. If any, like three, if you just fix them, I'm going to nap at this point with my squad. Yep, uh, we're coming back. I think we got it. Uh, Definitely. We gave him a black eye, I think. Definitely both, uh, both platoons yeah, ran sorry. straight into each other. Head to head. Everyone's going to pull back and re readjust their plan. Command for squad three. Go ahead, command. Uh, if you can back out to the northeast and uh, take up a position to the west of four and support his flank. Copy yeah, one. Yeah, squad four. We're starting to push south. I think they pulled south. Command two is at uh, patrol position one. We're going to toss radio down. Roger two. Next to be on the location of Hotel 92. Command, I'm sending two guys to you. I can see you're secure. Roger, if you send them to me, I'll go and place this. If you want to start moving south. I'm surprised Boogie hasn't seen them moving around, or maybe he has, he just doesn't have a good shot. Boogie's got eyes of an eagle. As one, one fob marker's been put down, that means that they've cleared that section. Two more, and they get to go back to their, well, go to their cop, they get that supply drop. Hopefully we can get on your western if we can help cover And they'll build up their defenses. Various def various defensive structures. Before if you've got a line of sight, I can drop mortars on them. You just need to request a tactical. I didn't copy, I'll try I'll try to get eyes on the Command, do you want to do to start moving south? Negative two. If you could uh, back out to the north. Command, request to uh, push down the gut. I got about uh, five guys, not including myself, under my command. We could possibly try to push through the center and get to that final location. It seems uh, like they, they have their stuff. They definitely got to push the through the maybe. Russian forces to get. Their last location. Until we get this second objective down, and then we'll make a plan to push the third. But if any of you guys see clumps of U.S. troops, you can request an attack. You need to request it by the map, six folk. So tactic. Yeah. So you just use your binos, uh, T-target, and request. up there on the south side of that ridge. Let's 
sitting at eight kills for the U.S. and three for the Russians. Four B advised. We got contacts in Gulf Nine Four Four. Looks like they're hard pointing up there. Yeah, copy. We're taking contact. From... And the Russia or the U.S. forces might be pulling back to around the last location. Them, then we can maybe cross the road and get more west as well. And we can fence. Uh, negative on that. We fell back west to disengage from enemy contact. Uh, I don't want to push back into them just yet. Yeah, understood. Uh, I see them. They're pulling west right now through, by the way. Ooh. All right, uh, Morgan, Turns off just a little bit. I'd like to say that uh, might be for our last point. I'd like one two to move north if you can, Rose. Cut. Once uh, Rose gets out of there north, then we're going to move three, four, and two to the west and then push on to Delta 1164. Delta 1164. Greta, do you want to start moving now to your, your west, maybe to around about depot? It's suppressing fire coming from the U.S. side. I think Alpha is going to be successful in his punch down the middle. It's going to. I think he's just going to take it wide. All right, Command is starting to head north now. Roger. Squad 2, if you can move north and west, so you're traveling t to the north of Squad 4. Once uh, two's across the road, 4, I want you to follow him. Understood. 4, I have a contact moving around in Gamma 10 9, direct south of. Yeah, light suppression to and four as you leave. I don't want them knowing you've uh, left until you've you've gone. And where'd you want light suppression? Uh, to your south, I believe, on the ridge line that I dropped the mortars. This contact there. Nice. Ah, that was nice. Good suppressing fire. Just a huge mag dump. Doesn't yield any results, but it definitely keeps their heads down. I guess that's a result. Four squad two is going to wrap to your north and go around you. Looks like Blackbeard has successfully gotten around the U.S. forces. Maybe these U.S. forces have spotted them and they're going to start coming towards them. This command is good too. Don't think Twister and Don't Get Shot are going to see them. That Russian force is probably coming out here just to Copy that. He's pushing get nine, eyes nine, on the next location, which is actually this field right here. Or it might, might be this compound. Right, yeah, like this so compound right here. So they're going to get eyes on that. Yep. You can just get set with eyes and the separation of the fire teams. Oops. To, uh, <laughs> I think it's going to be successful. Little. Once you've got their attention, then two and four should be able to push in behind them. I don't want to rush. Because if Blackbeard starts then, taking uh, shot, he can then, um, getting shots. Yeah, he can definitely pull these these individuals. Like 
into firing. They run into each other now. Copy that. Uh, command, my squad's gonna go pretty much almost straight south along the deck Delta Echo line, and we'll try to see if we can secure the hilltop to the north of the final objective. Solo copy three. I imagine you're gonna get a lot of heat from the east, and I'm hoping two and four will arrive just in time to save your bacon. Copy that. If we take uh, any heavy contact, we're probably just gonna hold. I'm not gonna try to force it. We don't got the numbers for that right now. Oh, and they just walk right past nuclear and don't get shot. Hopefully Steve, -O nope, Steve is not looking the right way. Oh, he is. They're firing all around him. Steve-O and Friction get two. Steve's Revy. Nuclear might spot him. One, where do you try to get contact from? We might be able to flank that. Put on Steve uh, and Friction. Directly on Delta 10 1. That's my fire team. There is also contact direct on Delta 10 3. Delta 10 3. Lorne, I want to push the objective now if that's alright. Get set before they can retreat. And the rest of the Russian forces are starting to run okay, down this way. way uh, if you can hold maybe for a minute or two to make sure it's uh, secure, safe, and then push. Just come out for something. Four. Dick's folk. Copy. Uh, you've got what looks like, uh, what, four in your squad, so if you could start pushing south, I want you uh, heading towards outpost, Foxtrot 1099. You're going to be covering Copy, the closest Foxtrot east, south, east. Oh, they're both so close to each other. Squad twos to squad. Friction's got to be ten. Same with Revy. Double check it before crossing. Squad two's taking contact from direct south. Looking right where he last saw contact. Two, if you need smoke, you can request it, and I can drop it so you can cross the road. Come here for squad one. I right, request inbound for smoke. Roger, drop. I'm going to try and buy this village now, Lorne. Fair to wait if you can for three to catch up. At least get the oh, get in contact. So once Guido's in contact, then push it. Cool. Looks like Guido's going to be in contact here very shortly. Two and four smokers in uh, ordered up should be there for you shortly. Seems they found Revy. You know, be advised, contact is within 150 meters direct south of you, moving west-east. Yeah, 150 meters south, moving west-east, copy. Hey, we had contact close up. Roger, all right, Scott, one, you're good to go. Do you want smoke in the point? Like, negative, negative, it's fucking nobody's home. I'll uh, just secure it, drop a radio, and uh, I'll drop a supply drop. Oh, Justice Blackbeard says it's that. All clear. We got, okay, stand by. Compound Echo 1114, Echo 1114 is occupied. Echo 1114, Roger. 
Sitting at eight kills for the Russians and 14 for U.S. Request. Command, be advised I'm down to just a fire team, including myself. We're trying to move south right now. We're going to just try to see if we can get straight into Delta 11, maybe. Roger. I don't see the request. Uh, fuck it. Can Man, you this is small four. We're trying to push south and take contact to the southwestern. We to continue pushing. Yes, please. Keep, keep, keep harassing them so they can reinforce uh, the last objective to your freedom move to your south. Copy that. We're going a little bit further west before crossing south. War is about the mortars incoming. Definitely get, uh, he's got himself in a pickle. Number two. Command, is anyone we can get smoke on that, uh, on the final objective so I can get my guys in? Yes, if you request it, I can, uh, drop. Actually, no, stretch, I, think we gotta, I think we gotta clear. Contact Echo 1114. Contact Echo 1149. Roger, 14. Ooh! Bagger survived that. Wow. Luck. I don't know how Lagger survived that, but uh, it must have hit right on top of that shed. Uh, it's command for squad four. If you could try and get to uh, Foxtrot 11 35 and then move west. Looks like four is going to be trailing behind two and three. Contacts on the hills to our west right now. Okay. What, whatever you think's best. Is a command for squad two. Go. I want you pushing compounds in Echo 11 8. There's a ridge to the north of that. You should be able to get set up. Copy that. Echo 11. Blackbeard, you able to drop uh, radio? Looks like Rose Dragon's getting told to move right where Frost is right now. There it is, they got the final one. Now they just gotta get to their cop location and start building supplies. Supply drop on the final objective in Delta 1164. Don't think that they're going to be able to build up the fences here. Under some heavy fire with the rest of the U.S. Uh, forces coming directly at them. Fend them off while two comes in to save the day and four comes in to clean up the uh, stragglers. There will be a supply drop. Uh, it's 1500 construction, 1500 ammo, uh, sandbag up as you see fit. You do have contacts around Echo 1014 and Delta 1036 area. Copy that. Here comes the supply drop. Going? Where's the plane? Where's the plane? There it is. I don't think a C-130 can fly plane, like plane that. One. Wow. Say again. Do you still have that image? Uh, negative. I have an AR. Can you get a body C-130 comes in hot. You should get a good crossfire and stop pushing us from the east from a uh, close distance frag. I know, I know this looks familiar, but this is actually a brand new op that was written uh, a couple of days ago, actually. It's command squad four. Copy squad four. Echo 1114, little town to the southeast of squad one, has infantry in it. That's your uh, objective. To get in behind them. Hey, Black, we're gonna have my whole fire team uh, down here because there are not many in this town. Is kind of terrible. No, right, copy that. Uh, just be aware of the fact that that, that compound at Echo Eleven to your direct east was occupied. We 
mortared it and don't expect that to have cleaned it out. Copy that one. Uh, two, you should expect contact in that village. I'm almost certain we didn't clear it out. Echo 1157. I hope Rose Dragon doesn't get caught from behind here, <laughs> here soon. Thanks, Kerr. You're my, I'm your biggest fan. Yeah, command for two, tracer fire coming from Echo 11-8, village to your southeast. Baron. Oh, you so close. One, you have contacts in the blue two-story building I'm to your out, east. Baby. Upper floor. Yeah, we know we've been shot from there for the last 10 minutes. <laughs> Go ahead. We're taking fire from our direct east. It sounds like Echo 1294. If you keep moving to your southwest, you might be able to clear out that ridge line from them. They're just to your west ground. Eminez takes a hit. So does Soldier Wolfie. Two's down. They look like they got flanked on their north. Eminez still down. Taking contact toward. Roger, two. If you can hold that ground best you can. A for. 16 to 8. Favor of US. Contact on my hill to the east, pushing us. You've got contact west. Requesting to kill us. And contact west. Yeah, uh, meeting eyes. Roger. Squad 2, are you able to move west to get out of that position? Hey. Two, I'll see if I can drop some smoke to help you get out of it. Four, we still got contact in the Echo 1114 town. Not sure if you can do anything about it. Alright, squad two, smoke is ordered up when it lands. That's your cue to try and make to it south. Uh, to the south. south. Break, 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 break. We've been flanked to our south. I've lost all but one. Miss squad four, we're engaging uh, CTC contacts with. We'll oh, contact south of three. You've also got contact four to your northwest. This has been a fast stop. <laughs> Live for I like thirty minutes. Roger, two. If you can make it west on that smoke to my current location west of the objective, once that smoke starts to land, should be any moment now. Man, be advising down to one other in my squad. We got hit pretty hard on the south side. Hopefully, leg up. You know what strength for it's, uh, bandages up. What was that command? Yep, never mind. Be advised, it's just down here now. Looks like a whole squad down folks south. coming in. Squad four is Smoke going out for oh over. savage. Some pen damage through the walls. Gonna break through. Oh. Ow. Good Do shot. I'm gonna throw, I'm gonna throw a frag up there. I'm gonna throw a frag. Oh, yeah. Squad four. All right, cancel out. Oh, good cleanup, Geist. Right. I gotta heal. There might be more upstairs. He's up there, upstairs in the house. There might be one. I'm unarmed in a bush, hoping my camouflage saves me. Roger, three good. Thank you. They are. They're probably Rudolph, in Delta let, 11. Let me know how many you think are down there. Uh, minimum fire team, maximum squad, probably somewhere in between. 
But it seems like uh, they hit with two elements, right. at least. Roger. All squads, if you're on the perimeter, hold, wait for them to assault. I think you found the perfect tree. Pick them off as they're trying to go in after one. I don't think they're going to see him. So make sure you pass that to your uh, squads if you've got command comms. Hold to ground, wait for them to assault one, and then re-push in. I don't know. US is doing pretty well. Looks like Russia is... Uh... Not doing too well. 24 to 14. 10 kill difference. But it could change in a heartbeat. Alright, let's start the north objective. MG fire close on my east. They're gonna assault us now. They just shelled us again. Roger. Alright, I'm bleeding. I may go down. Uh, if I do, best of luck. Oh, they got an eye on command. Never mind, never mind. I'm bandaging. Same here, I'm bandaging too. Fuck. This shit's so. Near this house, there's contact to our uh, east. Man, if I had to guess, say at least five or six to my direct south and southeast and close east. Roger, yeah, I got it up from over there. It's like two, two got wiped out on the north. Roger. A squad four situation report. Uh, we got one guy holding a house, and we shot through the walls a million times just to see if we got him, but we uh, There's three of us right. all alone. Roger. All right, so I think the majority of their forces are south of three at the moment. Look at that. Jimenez sweeps in, picks uh, on darts back up to health. Roger. Like a squad element moving in to four's position up there in that house. The guys down on my south have stopped shooting. They're either maneuvering or they're just waiting for another element to get in position. What's going on, Block? Uh, so I'm watching the right to your west. Copy. Got the phone. I hear it's popping smoke now. What's up, Yeah, they're going to try and hit us. Let's hit some fire. Oh, they are going hard yeah, on four in these buildings. Right west of you, four. West of you. Multiples in the field. West of you. Northeast of you, one. Down goes x -bit. Just lost their command. Right, I have, uh, They're no pushing outside. They're, outside. They're on the southwest side, one. This is the kind of thing that oh, could happen. Oh, good grenade. No one on the north. Alpha survived. Red smoke north of one. Red smoke north of one. 
Looks like you got at least one tagged boogie. Boogie. Uh, we lost four, so be advised there will be probably one or two Americans over to our east. About 100, 200 meters. Yeah, I can confirm just saw two guys over where four dot. Uh, they're moving south. Ah, uh, coming from the north. Echo 1146. Fire team assaulting your east side building. Alright, somebody killed someone next to me. Yeah, I got one. On the uh, right outside your building. But also, yeah, still got guys to the east. Who did he get? One on the radio, one on the radio. Roger, can Fisco get to Negative, negative. Can't stop him, we need someone else to hold the end. left. Three Russians left. All right, I'm out of bandages. I'm going to have to just push. Oh, probably going to end up with two. Two left. Command finally goes down. Kind of black beard and MS. Oh yeah, this is definitely one of those ops that could be good for 100 players. Might be a test for a 100 player op. Jimenez gets two. to Jimenez. Oh, so close. Pretty sure that's GG. Maybe GG? Yep, GG. So there you have it. Round one, Operation uh, Frigid Spider in the books. We are going to take a quick break and we'll be back. My guys are trained so well, they only listen to me and nobody else. Excluding Evan. Hey guys, welcome. Welcome to round two, well, Operation Frigid Spider. So we're going to be taking the red route. Um, the marks are on the map. Our first location is going to be the bridge to the west in Echo 67. And then we will be moving to the radio uh, station area. And then our final destination and point where we will reinforce and create a cop is there in Gulf, with a Gulf 12, four or something or other. I think it's, yeah, somewhere around there. It's like that. Okay. Once, uh, once we leave here, we're going to be doing sort of like a diamond formation. Oddball squad's going to be in the lead. Um, we'll put squad two on his left and squad four on his right. And squad three will be in the back in reserve. Uh, basic plan is, is we're going to get there, drop our fobs and keep moving. We're going to use overwhelming firepower if we hit contact. Uh, if we do, and it's holding us up, 
the squad holding that contact will hold it. The other squads will maneuver on it, clear it off. That's the basic plan. So we'll be just moving in a kind of like a diamond formation as a full platoon all the way from north to south. Um, trying to keep close to each other so that we can help each other and then breaking off the flank and or clear contact as necessary. Any questions? Yeah, can you repeat that whole brief? I had to pee. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Don't. Frost, he's jo a joke. Yes. Frost, you're gonna have to, you're gonna have to get that guy in line. <laughs> yes, will do. He will be punished with one million push-ups. All right. <laughs> um, that's the basic plan, guys. Uh, good luck. You guys did really well round one. So just remember and you just use the concealment cover as you can when maneuvering through these forests. Don't uh, you know? Don't. Uh, Push yourself too hard into the open if you need to. Just maneuver around it. Bounding's really good. Um, and as your squad leads and fire teams know, they'll, they'll, they'll do the appropriate stuff to get you across those open fields as necessary. But that's the basic plan. North and south, drop a fob at each, and then hopefully uh, we can all sit there in our barn in Golf 12 and have a fun time. Okay, that's it. Squad leads, break them out, get set up in formation. There we go. You guys are live. Go. I don't know why we haven't oh, broadcasted yet. There we are, live. Round two. All right, let's move out. Hopefully, the Russian or the U.S. forces haven't gotten a leg up on them, but we are live. Round two. Operation Frigid Spider. Let's see a nice clean fight. No hits below the belt. Fighters, take your corners. Okay, well, if I'm the tip of the spear, who's getting on the north side of my spear? I'm just gonna go. And we're just hardballing it to the first point, yeah? yeah. You say hardballing or oddballing it straight to the point? I think I heard oddballing it straight to the point. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna see contact that fast. Let's let's fly down and see where the Russian forces are moving. That's what two and one going in between. Was that uh, radio tower? I don't know why those fob markers are up because that's not where they're going. That might be U.S. force marks. See four going up towards train bridge. I wonder if they'll actually. S how far? How long is the train okay, bridge we'll the road the view? Oh no, they're not going to see them. Never mind. That's Dick Folk Squad. I wonder how far out they'll push from Radio Tower. Looks like two's pushing pretty far. One's holding their position. In case someone goes down that eastern flank and tries to push Radio Tower from there, but they're going to be pushing straight from Train Bridge. Looks like two is moving the fastest. They're going to push past Radio Tower. Probably the to defend anyone coming from radio tower toward or from train bridge towards radio tower squad five oddball hello come on all right we're going to start pivoting south so squad two, you will set the radio on the bridge. Squad four, you can hold and start vitting south. And wait until five gets out in front of you. Roger, four is hold. 
Oh, two and four are beeline, and it's straight for uh, bridge. I think that's squad three that's sitting over there. Oh, squad one. Where'd squad three go? Lost them. Okay, so they're holding back down that way. I have a feeling that uh, Lawn Darts doesn't know that they're going the red route. So he's sending people to the different positions just in case. Here's where they got to put the first radio. Oddballs, start moving south. Roger, moving south, you don't want us to... No, no, just south. Squad 2 will drop the radio. I want to I wanna try to... I wanna try to... Okay, I'm just... Uh, my... Yeah, that's okay. I like what you're doing. I'm basically the pivoting squad here. Or the beginning of the pivot. Pivot? I just said pivot like three times to my squad and nobody laughed. I don't think they watched the show. That would definitely be the time to buddy, buddy bound, buddy team bound, or fire team bound. Looks like that's what Oddball's doing. I have a feeling Rusty Shackelford's going to get mowed down staying in that open area. And unless he gets up. And do you want me to hit the uh, second objective from the late position, uh, Echo 885, or from the northwest? Uh, from the north. Direct south or through Echo 7 Alright, co right, copy that three. Go ahead and put fire on. Squad 5, continue to your southwest. Contact on fire. I copy that file. Two's talking any cover here, we're just gonna show up for the fun. Copy that too. Let's overrun the fire panel, gentlemen. Push them off, we mortar mark. Two, we have a good grid, southwest so I can... of five. Check your southwest. Yeah, I'm surprised they didn't see each other, but. Like I was saying in the first round, there's a lot of foliage, a lot of trees, and the Russians really do blend in and we change the American, well, not we, Mod Dev changed the American camo to be the old camouflage. So it's hard to see them. Squad 4, it looks like you're pivoting to the west. Go ahead and move your to west. I call that part of the transmission. You're doing fine, 4. Just keep moving to the west. Try to get this contact off of 5. Easy peasy. Just to your southwest, we took him. Don't forget about three. Confirmed a second. It's a reminder for myself. Someone write that down for me. That way I don't forget. Scott, two, can you get a mortar mark down for the I'm gonna have my fire team push direct south of my battle fight. Copy, team. Go ahead. 
Heavy enemy contact in the village my squad is in. A um, bunch of smokes, a bunch of grenades. They're in this village, at least one squad. Alright, copy that for. Don't get engaged too much in their urban environment. Just hold your position and let them come to you. Uh, definitely looks like Russia is going to have to fight for the next two objectives. Get contact to my southwest west is across the road here. Alright, copy that. Find some hard cover, cover guys. Side. Start nailing heads as they pop. Suppress some overwhelming firepower. Drop a lot of ammo. If you got mortar missions, pull them out. Put them on the map, please. Squad 2, if you mark a mortar mission 150 meters southwest, down. Uh, Command, uh, contact closers. Close by. Oh, storm. Oh, storm. Command, mortar mission. Oh, storm. Five, uh, in the tree line, Delta 788. Eight. Nice, nice, nice. Oh. oh, Frost! 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 Oh. <laughs> Ow. Probably too much going on. He can't hear anything. That fire going all around him. Ten bucks says Storm makes it out of this. Damn it. Just lost ten dollars to myself. And Frost is by himself. <laughs> oh no. Squads two and five. There is a smoke mission coming in. Once it starts dropping, I want you to move to your southeast where squad three and four is. Break contact under spot. Good eyes with Raggy and uh, Boogie over there. Two of you bound first, we'll cover you. For a possible contest to your west. I need a second here, I just got you. Yeah, there's, there's contacts uh, directly on me as well right now. I'm trying to flank around them. Uh, I'm tracking with. Looks like Frost got some reinforcements. Much needed reinforcements. I don't know how Tinkerbell made it up there. Spot. Oh! Good mortars right on top of Boogie and Mr. Raggy. Alright, two and five, disengage far Take some east. Try to move both out. That, that village, that squad four is south of. Bondart's concentrated that fire mission. And there's three. Causing some hate from behind. And copy that. Squad, uh, squad three is going to integrate with two and five. Doesn't sound like they've been called out yet. We're firing, maneuvering, gentlemen. Keep moving to your east. Uh, enemy contacts reported northeast of my position, approximately two to three hundred meters. I'm um, getting my guys to pull off and pull a 360, waiting for you guys to rejoin. Uh, two, two and three. It looks like you're gonna be going straight. This is a right one life operation in squad. Yeah, a yeah. custom game mode that we do here at Squad Ops. Uh, you get one life on, per round. Life. Play two rounds. Uh, a mission keep east that is written. Meters, you're gonna go into the 
I'll post that. Maybe get an idea of Understood. what's going on. And open up that document and uh, see what is. See the forces, see what they have. See what the mission is. Kind of like if you ever played Arma, kind of like a, a Zeus one off mission. Except for there's no one calling in AIs and things like that. Out there all by yourself for a while, so just get tight. Tracking all. The Rose Dragon's gonna have a great day, or he's gonna have a bad day. And I hate to say it, but I hope it's a good day. Yeah, very much unlike uh, vanilla gameplay for squad. No revives. You can only get healed if you're still up. Check out the game. It's uh, very fun. Very immersive. Watch your Bravo team. They're going to walk into a mortar mission. Uh, you need to buy this game. Uh, player count right now is 80 on 80. Or, I'm sorry, 80 players. So 40 on 40. Uh, hopefully this week or maybe next week they're gonna bump that up to 100 players so they'll have 50 on 50. very active community discord is discord.gg slash squad ops uh, we also have a website that you can sign up uh, to take place in these operations website squad ops.gg once you make an account on the website, link it up in the Discord, and then attend a SOT basic course, which gets posted on the calendar, you know, usually two to seven days beforehand. Right you actually have one this Saturday. After you take seconds. that SOT basic, you can sign up and uh, get in on these One Life events. Yeah, you can push up in the hills, but two's already tracking that. I'm directly northeast of them. I mean, if two like a lot of the Russian it, forces yeah, have pulled but... back. This is the next objective here. These radio towers. To the Alpha yeah, Guido is defending that position. If he sees, if he see contacts, Toasty. As the rest of the Russian forces move in to clear out Rose Dragon Squad Three. They're mortars. Smoke oh, smokes. Oh no, those are mortars. Dust. All frost. Those enemy mortars are uh, south of us right now. Yeah, 50 50 is very fun. I got to try it out in the test client. I think it is better. Uh, a lot more infantry players. Uh, it's not like how it has been where it's all vehicles and a couple infantry squads it's i think it really evens it out i think they still need to take away some of the vehicles right, on some of the layers it's just vehicle bloat there's way yeah, too many vehicles to on some layers all right copy two still has contacts just to my east all right copy. Five, once you're in position at the edge of town, move to your southwest and take the high ground on Fox 85. Oh. Fox 85, right?
I always wondered if they stole this tree stand from Arma. It looks just like the ones in Arma 3. I should say Arma 2, like in DayZ. Looks just like them. All before the storm. Calm before the storm. Real quick, we got nine kills for the Russian forces and seven for the U.S. Still pretty even. Hopping off. Squad two, leave. Go. Two, uh, once you clear that off, go ahead and move south so that you're south of where Squad is now on the ridge here in Fox 83. Cabby, we think these contacts will go off somewhere. Not sure as to where. Most likely eastern. Alright, copy that. Just keep watching your six. Five's gonna take a crack across the road. We're gonna go across the road with a fight. Yeah, so far it has been closer. I'm kind of surprised. I would have thought how Xbit was moving forward with basically the entire platoon going against two squads that would have been a higher kill count. Hey, US did their job. Held their positions. I need wide tips of fire due south and southwest, please. Like young savages moving in right behind the squad here at Dukins. pushing the way in everybody filter and funnel in between five as they cross over we're gonna all gonna rally at the radio copy once five's across three will push command two two is tied up on the northeast we got contact at least a i do not know how silver is still alive <laughs> Good mortars. Down goes airborne. Six 
silver finally goes down. Might have been a shot from X bit. Command's getting into the fight. We just lost, uh, Adakin. Back to you. Try to break contact. This is three. We lost. We lost someone too, and more. Alright, copy that. We're, we're losing momentum here. We need to get across this road and get onto radio quick. Oh. Hukin's losing people. Five in command. I'm gonna push my squad to you guys so we have more man like hot mics doing some work oh hot mic on fire that two kills what everyone else doing leading the way oh someone got s oh man, young savage got four this position Shoot. Eight, three. Got 14 kills for the Russians and 16 for the army. U.S. Only Heta and Raptor force over here. Experts getting wrapped around on. Dick folks moving in. Alright, I got the remnants of my squad um, pushing just south of 5 into radio. that for what happened to two it looks like they got deleted oh good nade on lego contact directly west of you far near the rock uh, west and south actually Let's start bounding up under fire again one fire team lay down the fire, another one bound. It's bound up. Oh. Yep. We're in CQC. They are surrounded. Not a good place to be. Oh, nuclear and expert traded. See if Heta and Raptor Force can do some cleanup. Oh, Heta can't. Heta. Squad four, you've got contacts at these rocks southwest of you, Cloak. Twenty-four to twenty-two, still even, but the Russian forces are, well, we're surrounded. It's like Eyeball was able to push through. I mean, if Eyeball can get this. And then just have everyone beeline to the last one. This will end up being pretty good.
Your general idea there, Bomb Spy, is absolutely correct. This command is going to pull back. As he one taps oddball. After force is still up over there. Uh, it's enforced by the squad system. And our rules, you can't just join another squad because your squad is all down. Squad five, uh, squad leader down. Roger, tracking. Um, make sure everybody, even, even, uh, blueberries that aren't in your squad, let them know that taking this point is currently on mid. That's our main goal, copy. Oh, oh, command comms now. Five on point six counting Raptor Force over there. He's getting to the fight. Our main objective right now is to take this. It's just here comes me Alpha. You, man. Um, there's some kind of accurate fire coming in from the northwest on the hit. You need to take Echo 9 9. I know that for sure. Remember what the points were, it's E99, and then we gotta make our way to G124 to put down our cop. Copy. I think last, uh, last transmission was Frost, take this. Just focus on the yeah, point right now. Yep, I know it's Echo 99 Actually, for objective, we should start oh, leaving no. if possible. Squad leader can put down a, uh, fob, so they're still good. As long as they have a squad leader, they can put down a fob. Well, squad leader alive. Down goes Joshy. Four left on point. Raptor force is dialed. Left to these four on point. Nightmare, Fluffs, Liberal, and Delshawn. Four against eight. They can do it. They can pull it off. They can get the radio down. I don't know if anyone alive is alive that can actually place it down. And no, they don't have. They don't have a. They have no way of doing a radio. But no, Delshawn can put a radio down. Sorry. Hope Delshawn knows that. Ooh. Down goes Alpha, or I'm sorry, Lawn Darts. Alpha is hurt. I think that was Fluffs.
Oh, down goes Delshawn. Left the liberal nightmare and fluffs. I have no way to put a radio down now. Oh. And fluffs and liberal are the only ones left. You gotta be kidding me. I just crashed. Oh, at the end. Oh, no. You have got to be kidding me. Right at the end. Let's see if I can get back in. Gave me no warning, nothing. It just shut down. Can't see anything. Oh. Yep. Yep. Game's over. God, I'm so sorry about that. I can't believe that. It just crashed for no reason whatsoever. I'm pretty sure US won. Man. Well, calendar.